There was once a merchant who came before the great sage, the Khatam Sofer. Rabbi, my business isn't doing well. Perhaps you could say a blessing that I should be prosperous. The rabbi thought for a while. My friend, I see your brother also has a business, and that his is failing even more. He's in a poorer state, but you are doing nothing to help him. As I told you, I'm in a bad way. I need your blessing. Maybe if times were different. You know, my friend, there's a verse in the Torah where God is talking to Moses about the Israelites in Egypt. He says, V'gam ani shamati et na'akat b'nei Yisrael. God says, I too have seen the suffering of b'nei Yisrael. Why do you think God says, I too? God heard their cry. He rescued them. Rabbi, I want God's blessing. Ah, you must pay attention to the words. I too heard their cry. They all heard each other's cry, although they were suffering. And God too heard their cry. When their ears were opened to hear each other's plight, then God too listened. My friend, God's blessing will come to you, and he'll hear your needs, just as soon as you start to wake up to the needs of those around you. Pesach can be quite a costly and demanding season. Communities have always encouraged kimcha de pischa, donations to help the needier members, buy matzah and wine for their seder. Please give your support to those around you. Contact your shul or local welfare charity. Invite people into your home, and may God bless you and your families with prosperity and redemption.